Hi, this is Coach Doc Cindy, and you're getting another professor's listening to me talk about what I teach some of my students. And we just went through this round in one of the courses that I was teaching, which was on management and leadership. So today we're specifically talking about SMART goals. SMART, it's an acronym. It's a easiest way to remember SMART. So when you set up a goal, it needs to be specific. That's the S. You have to define the goal with no unclear language, lay it out, who, what, where, why, which, like everything has to be broken down. So that lays the groundwork. M, M is measurable. Can you track the progress? Can you make the outcomes measurable? How much, how many, how will you know when you reach your goal? So that's the measuring part. A, it has to be attainable. It has to be achievable. Is it reasonable to accomplish this? If it is, how? How is it reasonable? Make sure it's not some far-fetched thing or you're reaching even below your standards. Set yourself up for success with this. The R, relevant. Relevant really is, is the goal worthwhile? Does it meet your needs? Does it help you? Is it consistent with any other goals that you've set? Or is it in alignment with the other goals that you set? Will you have to make sure that it fits your in your immediate and your long-term plans. So it has to go in, in alignment with it and coincide with other things that you're doing. So it's not something out in left field. And the T in SMART is timely. Timely, you have to include a time limit. Each step has to have a time, a month, a day, a year, hours, whatever it takes. You establish a sense of urgency to work on your goal if you have a time frame and you'll do better time management if you know you need to hit goals by a certain time. So S-M-A-R-T, so specific, measurable, attainable, and you can also use achievable, relevant, and timely. That's the acronym. That is what SMART stands for. And that is how we set up your goals.